Hey guys, so I am getting ready to head out to the airport because I am flying to Sacramento this weekend to do a boudoir marathon. So, but I still wanted to do a video for you guys, so this is just a really quick video, okay? Um, I've been shooting a lot of couples boudoir lately, so I thought that I would share with you guys some tips on what I feel like kind of really shows some passion and emotion between the couple. So one thing I really noticed is that with shooting a couple, you really want to show some sort of passion or passionate action between the couple. So composition, I think, is really, really important. So you don't want to compose it too tightly or, you know, to hide their bodies or anything like that because I think that that interaction between their bodies and them is what really, really makes a session. So make sure that, you know, you give yourself a lot of space. Um, don't hide between behind bubbles or blankets and things like that, you know. Just give it kind of openness um, so that way you can kind of see that interaction between them. So that's my first tip. My second tip is about getting close. They're going to get much closer than they would, say, for instance, in an engagement session. So you want to tell them to get really close. They have to press their bodies really, really close together. And this action is actually really, really great for the woman in the situation because when she presses her body really close to him, it makes her look thinner. Um, so this really helps. So have them press their bodies really close. That's my second tip. My third tip is that there's going to be a lot of kissing on like the shoulder and the neck area. You know, you want him to get in really, really close and get in tight here, um, even with her you know if she wants to do that as well to kind of snuggle in with each other um, and when they are kissing you don't want them to actually lock lips really um, I think that in action of actually kissing makes their faces look like they're really smushed together and they give them these little duck lips so you just tell them to get in really close as close as you can without actually touching lips and I actually like that a lot better because it shows a lot of passion the moment before the kiss um, that is really great you also want to give them actions to do um, like tugging that shirt so pull in and pull up pull out um, you know and touching body parts that you normally probably wouldn't ask them to touch if they were outside like during an engagement shoot um, the butt is always like a good area um, as well so you kind of just want um, to you know instruct them on you know where to put their hands um, and you know the the tugging action um, is always always great Okay, the other thing I would suggest is usually try to concentrate on the girl more than the guy. Just like at a wedding, you want to concentrate on the bride a little bit more than you would concentrate on the groom. Although the groom is important, um, it always looks a little bit better if you concentrate and make the woman look beautiful. Um, and then guys are just really natural and um, a little bit more confident in their own skin. Uh, so yeah, try to concentrate on the girl. And then my other last tip is if they're laying down or even in any situation, have her arch her back towards him. This gives like an emotion of wanting or desire. Um, so, you know, especially if she's on her back, you know, arching her back towards him, um, that kind of just gives that a little bit more sensual feeling about it. And then if she's on her, on top of him, um, you always want her to have this nice curve. You want to make sure that she has this nice beautiful arch on her back. Um, so that gives her this nice curvy lines um, running all the way down her body okay so those are my tips for shooting boudoir or couples boudoir if you have any questions you're welcome to message me like always um, and I do videos every Monday Wednesday and Friday so please subscribe to this channel otherwise I will talk to you Monday bye